This custom room is so improved. I use this custom room after some time right now, maybe around two months after two months actually. And it's quite improved in the terms of features, in the terms of UI, in the terms of a lot more other things. Of course, the performance is also one of the things to consider. It's actually quite good. We are talking about Project Blaze. The version is 3.6 while making this video and it's having updated to the latest security patch with the latest Android version. Android 14 with the July security patch. Tested it on my device, which is Elliot, which you can say Mi 11X, Poco F3 or Redmi K40. All, all of these devices are literally same. Some of the changes includes the dialer. In previous updates, the dialer was a Google dialer in the Google Apps version. In the vanilla version, without Google Apps, it was already this kind of dialer. So of course, call recording without announcement is actually possible here. Moving on to some of the wallpapers UI, you can you will see that we have new wallpapers introduced with Project Blaze section. And personally speaking, some of these wallpapers are just damn cool. These wallpapers are pre-included like the one I've just shown you, but some of these wallpapers like this, this is quite amazing and new looking. It depends which type of wallpaper do you love and you can apply it on a device. Some of these wallpapers like this one, the, uh, the one I have applied right now on my home screen looks quite amazing. This is also, this is the default one and yes, these are just so amazing. Also moving on to the settings UI, you will notice some changes here. Settings UI can be changed, which is a very good thing. Like in some custom rooms, the settings UI if even if it is modified some people might love that some people might not but in this case we have two options available so whichever you feel comfortable with you can choose it so that's a good thing then you can customize it that you can customize these options directly from the customization section the settings UI, by the way which is by default this one is looking not bad also if, if i move on to the gesture navigation you will notice that ime space hiding the ime space option is present i always mention that this is one of my favorite features and this should be available this should be present in most of the custom rooms and project blaze is one of them where this feature is already integrated also with the new update or basically the updates when i used this custom room after after two months i've used this these features were not there like the lock screen clocks these features are quite common right now in most of the custom rooms these are present and yes project blaze is also one of them you can see lock screen has the ios style lock ios style clock which is looking good but you can even use any other clocks in case you want to minimal ide stylish all these options are actually present in most of the custom rooms which support customizations you can choose any one of them by the way in the terms of lock screen clock we do not have the option to enable the widgets which is of course kind of really okay depth wallpaper which was expected it's already there so if you enable depth wallpaper the lock screen might look quite better it depends how you customize and how you give look to your device if i move on to the spoofing options you will notice unlimited photo storage higher fps in games and netflix spoofing all these options are present here which are quite common the snapchat spoofing option is missing but i don't think so most of you might use if it is available it's good but if you don't use it then it's completely okay if I move on to the theming options, you will notice we have all the fonts which you were expected, which you were expecting. All these options are present here. Cocon is the font which I'm using right now. Signal icons, Wi-Fi icons, and else, same options are present here. Some of these icon packs, I mean, if, if your custom room does not have these kind of things, you can also get them very easily with the help of some modules, like one of them is Iconify. If you move on to the quick settings panel, the quick settings panel also has a by default Android 11 style quick settings panel enabled, which is actually quite good. As I previously mentioned too, that in some of the custom rooms, if you want to enable Android 11 style quick settings panel, you have to adjust the rows and columns and then you can make it look like Android 11. But in Project Blaze, you have these styles available. So you can directly switch between Android 14 and Android 11 quick settings panel, no extra steps. And in my personal opinion, this is better better as compared to some of the other custom rooms of course it's just better that doesn't mean that other custom rooms are bad sometimes some things are just slightly better according to or basically compared to some other custom rooms 
else we have similar kind of things available which are quite common and available in most of the custom rooms so yes these were things i just wanted to let you know in case you want to try this custom room on a device link is already there in the description check out if it is available officially it's good even if it is not available officially unofficially it's present then don't miss it too you can try that on a device in case you want to this is it these were things i just wanted to let you know hope you like this if you like this video don't forget to drop a like and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe to the channel we'll see you in the next one